January 9th. Uh, broke out my clam shack. Starting to get more heavy duty. I even brought my power auger. Uh, it started on the second pole after sitting in my garage all summer, so that was cool. And now I'm with team member Jared. How are you doing, Jared? Good. Okay, Jared's my cousin-in-law from upstate New York. <laughs> so anyway, we're gonna go. Uh, we're gonna go hit Lake Shano. Try our luck. Jared said he caught a couple fish last week, so he's gonna. Sh he's taking me out. So better put me on some fish, Jared. Hopefully. <laughs> All right. The green hornet. Let's hope so. Jared made that himself. So just like uh, Muskie Mike and uh, and uh, Cody, they have one like that also. Oh yeah, just rattled that guy right in. I was talking on the phone with Scrapper through my phone and uh, rattled in a nice largemouth bass on the rattler. Really? Yep. Oh, yeah. Show Jared. Jared, you said you got one already. Too. Nice. How you doing? You getting any? No, I saw some some uh, bluegills, but that was it. All right, cool. Well, it didn't take long. No. Went on the board. I'm letting them go. All right. Okay, got my new uh, rod. Got uh, just a one-to-one -one reel. Pretty, uh, it's a frable. Um, and I got a pretty fancy little fishing rod I picked up at Fleet Farm yesterday. Um, it's 20 inch. I keep, I like, I like them short for inside my pack shack, and it's got a pretty flexible tip. So this is the new rod and reel combo. Got the reel at a swap meet. I got actually three of these for a really good price, and now I got a nice rod to go with it. So let's see if we can catch some fish. I'm out on Lake Shano. Um, just uh, walked out, hit the first drop off, and here I am. So far, I got that largemouth bass, and had a couple lookers here, but can't get them to bite yet. We'll see what happens. Here's my jig. Okay, there's fish coming in. Checking out, checking out my jig right now. Gotta watch my rod tip. See if we can get him to bite. He's looking. He's looking. Come on. Oh, oh, he nibbled. He gave a little nibble there. It's nice and warm in the shack here. We got the heat rolling, and the fish are starting to pick up. Got a little crappie. Got a bluegill. Um, not huge, but definitely keepers. I'm gonna keep these guys to make a meal. Jared, uh, he said orange was working, so I just put a little orange uh, ball head jig, and I'm putting uh, wax worms on that. And that's that's all so far. That's what's working for uh, that crop being bluegill. Um, the rattler over there, that was uh, that's what caught my large mouth. But uh, right now, I'm gonna work on these panfish. Okay, I just had a bite. Let's see if I can get him to bite again. Had a little flurry here. Fish got active. I got a couple, couple. Uh, I got a crappie and another bluegill, and then some smaller ones I threw back. Uh, none of them are huge. They're just big enough to keep. Definitely got uh, some fish down there. Checking it out. The top lines my jig at the five foot mark there. And uh, you know, I keep teasing them, I raise it up. Try to get chasers. A lot of times you get them to chase, then they'll commit. You, know, you get a bite. Pull in a little bigger crappie. It's not too bad. Uh, gotta get down there, and there's some more down there, so I'll try to get another one. Got one looking. Let's see if we can catch this guy. He's starting to run on the light. Oh yeah, fish on. Oh yeah, it feels good. This guy feels pretty good. Let's see what oh yeah, nice big gill. Let's slit him on. Here's the gill. Uh that's probably the biggest one so far. It's about seven inch, eight inch. So the other ones are just eaters. So, cool. Hope they can catch some more. I'm gonna kind of run it out of light, so uh, not too much more video. I've been using it a uh, little mamushka on that guy. 
Uh, earlier I was using orange and anyway it's all working okay we're going into Jared's domain how you doing Jared? No, oh, not very good what? <laughs> Need to put on a new wax for him he just got a crappie he's caught several uh, bluegills and stuff he just hasn't got on too big of ones right? no I threw the small one, smaller ones back and kept a small one for the cat yeah cool you keep that last crappie or is that yeah. small too? Oh yeah, look at that. There's a nice crappie. Cool. Good job, buddy. Right on the bottom. Yeah. Yep. Give her a hill. Oh, yeah, trying. Alright, we're kind of out of light now, so uh, that's going to be probably it for the video. I got uh, 11 uh, in the bag and you got a couple, so cool. Nice day. Give her hell. hill. Yep, absolutely. Probably get a couple more yet before we go. Try. All right. <laughs>